is why I am proud to announce the new Sharknado Task Force to defend our great nation against these disasters. These SNTF teams will be sent out to the site of any suspected Sharknados in order to dispose of them using non-lethal explosives. With the goal of keeping both our homes and the sharks safe for many years to come. If you would like to apply to be a part of this task force, just go to stnf.us.gov or call 7467-7367-7926. Dear Lord. And so, the poor just means Haitians have been trying to... Oh, I'm sorry, gotta take this. Hello? Mr. President? No, it's not another Sharknado. It's something worse. What is that? I gotta go to the marine biologist lab. I'm looking for the guy in charge. Who are you? I'm the ninja assistant. Isn't that a little cheesy? Shut up. What's the problem, officer? There's another shark needle rampa rampaging through downtown. We were just talking about that. It's already in downtown? That's quite alarming. You already knew? How come you haven't done anything? I'm afraid there isn't much we can do. What about the shark NATO task force? Won't work. Why not? Paige, here to explain. This isn't a normal shark NATO. It's a porpoise NATO. <laughs> That actually sounds more cute than scary. You see, Sharknadoes are normally class 0 to 3, but this is a class 6 tornado. I thought there were only 5 classes of tornadoes. There are. This is the most powerful tornado we've ever seen. Not to mention that it's chock full of porpoises that have been mutated to be intelligent and hyper aggressive. How can we fight it? We can't. So we just give up? Well, I mean, we, we have some. Oh. It's for you, Sensei. Don't call me Sensei. You're getting a call from the porpoises. A call from the porpoises? Do they have a phone? Yeah, look right here. Porpoises. What are they saying? I can't really make it out. My porpoise is a little rusty. Uh, let's use the auto translator. Hold on one sec, porpoises. tornado in a completely unprotected area with just a couple of swords for protection just because some mutated porpoises told us to? Yeah, were you not listening? Come on. Nobody's here. Come on. Porpoises, we're here. We're ready to make a deal. near. Stay vigilant. Use this for protection. Where are they? I'm sorry. Wait, what? <laughs> <sighs> 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 Why are you doing this? They took my last McRib! That doesn't answer my question. They're seasonal! <sighs> 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 You leave me no choice. Why is dying so uncomfortable? I think I'm laying on something. The McRib! I had it the whole time. I think I'm gonna die now. Why was he our president? The porpoises are upon us. Take the law into my own hands.
too many of them. Maybe we should like reverse the polarity or something. What is that gonna do? That has nothing to do with tornadoes. Wait, he's right. How did that work? Science. And I thought you were the logical one. What do we do now? Sunset walk. Wait, didn't you die? Shh, it's supposed to be a happy ending. So we meet again. Anton! I see you've blown my cover. Watch him rollin', watch him go, watch him rollin', watch him go, watch him rollin', watch him go, watch him rollin', watch him go. Are we gonna get him back? No, if we do, we're gonna get chased down by a group. We need to get our boss back. Without him, our group is going to fade. Shocking news. Services are also criminal gangs. We will send out police to arrest both forces and lead this nation back to justice. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, so stay safe. He be rolling down the street. He be rolling to the beat. He be rolling down the street. He be rolling to the beat. Oh dear, I hope my guests get here soon. Oh, that must be Thomas. Hello, Thomas. How are you? How's the family? Fine, and so is the family. And you? I'm well. And the dining room's this way, too. Thank you, Diana. Hello, Claire. A happy birthday. Thank you. Um, the dining room is this way. Thomas White has already arrived. Oh, happy birthday, Clara. Thank you, James. And thank you, Diana, for letting us use your beautiful house. 
we didn't mention it, you can come over anytime. And also, thank you, Thomas, for joining us. Oh, welcome. I enjoy being here. Drinks. That obviously must have been the cause of Clara's death. Of course. Why else would there be blood on it? And analyze it. Thank you, officer. I'm just doing my job, and I'm sorry for the loss. I analyzed the knife as well as the blood. The knife was indeed a murder weapon, and it contained fingerprints. Some were Clara's, and some were, uh, were Thomas White's. I knew it. Oh, how smart of you, but if you want to arrest me, you'll have to catch me first. I'm on my ride. How's the family? <laughs> Action! Gotcha! Oh. Uh, no, you don't got him. Action! Action! Drinks! Why, thank you. Yummy! <laughs> what was that? Camera rolling. Action! Drinks! <laughs> yes. Action! Happy birthday, Clara! Well, thank you, James! And thank you, Diana, for letting us use your beautiful house! You need a desk. You can come over anytime. And thank you! <laughs> I almost said James. I'm sorry. I was gonna say James. <laughs> okay, can we, go with it. can we not cut all of this out and just start from her line? Oh, yeah, you can go to the other side. Action! Happy birthday, Clara. Oh, thank you, James. And thank you, Diana, for letting us use your beautiful house. You need a desk. You can come over anytime. And thank you, Thomas, for joining us. I forgot my lines. <laughs> <laughs> Action! Happy birthday, Clara. Oh, thank you, James. And thank you, Diana, for letting us use your beautiful house. You need a desk. You can come over anytime. <laughs> I did so good! I did so Action! Happy birthday, Clara. <laughs> Why is yes. that? Action! Happy birthday, Clara. Oh, thank you, James. <laughs> you laugh! <laughs> Action! Happy birthday, Clara. Oh, thank you, James. <laughs> Action! Happy birthday, Clara. <laughs> what? Action. Happy birthday, Clara. Oh, thank you, James. And thank you, Diana, for letting us use your beautiful house. You need it, as You can come over anytime you want. <laughs> Action! <gasps> oh, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Action! Time to put it behind bars, Mr. White. Action! Happy birthday, Clara. Oh, thank you, James. And thank you, Diana. Once upon a time, a time there was a there girl. Was a girl. A girl, a girl with a with pair, a pair of, rainbow of rainbow socks. socks. These socks These were not everyday, not everyday socks. socks. They were magical. magical. They made the they wearer very lucky, lucky, completely immortal, as long as they were on their feet. 
The only the catch, only catch was, was they made the wearer insane. Wear insane. Everyone, Everyone. Wore them. Slap the owner across the face with them. The new owner would often murder the former possessor of the socks for good measure. The mystical socks passed from person to person, 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 person over generations, generations and generations. generations. Hundreds, hundreds and hundreds, hundreds of, of years. years. Lucky, rich, and famous. Maybe. Straight A's. I want straight A's. There's a trail of violence on the socks. The person who owns it, they're mad. It's madness. I wouldn't go crazy. Whatever. The socks don't even exist. Look, the socks are on the newspaper. I want them. I want them. What are you talking about? Look, they're real. You don't even know where to find them. It says it right here. Mackenzie owns them. Let's go on a journey! Or else, insanity will soon come to you. Destroy them. You will wish you had put them on. Death or destroy. Insanity. 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 Insanity.
should stay still. The closet of room 306. We could go that. We could use beds. They have beds. Yeah, they have beds. Real beds, not wooden poop loaded <laughs> platforms. Yeah, we should use those. Let's Can use we use that. those? Can yeah. somebody take the action? Remember, you have to slap her in the face to get the power.